Coverage you can count on continues with Sarah Schaefer and meteorologist Rob Leidick. Classic and creative cars will be on display all week long in Auburn. And that's all part of the Auburn Core Duesenberg Festival, and that actually kicks off tomorrow. Here to tell us more about it is Sarah Payne. Thanks so much for joining us today. Thanks for having me. So the ACD Festival, one of my favorite events that happens here in Northeast Indiana. How did this all get started? Well, this is our 60th anniversary. So 60 wow. years ago, we actually had Auburn's Cords and Duesenberg club members come in and bring their car in for a reunion. And every year I still think that's really the bulk of what this is about, is a reunion for all these car owners to come in, they get back together again. I had a car owner the other day step in my office and say, it's his favorite holiday of the year. It's, it's like getting back with his family. So uh, I think that is really um, true even today. But 60 years ago, that's how it started. And then talk about what goes on. Um, we were saying you just you can bring your car up and park it and explain to everybody what goes on there. Sure. Well, of course, it's Auburn is known for its cars. So there's auctions and cruise-ins. Uh, anyone can bring their car to our cruise-in on Friday night. And it is uh, a really all-makes, all-model show. There's all kinds of cars available. Um, the auction parks are really fun because there's lots of things that you can see and do there. Um, but I always think the thing that we sometimes um, forget to talk about is there's more than just cars. Mm -hmm. So there's live music. There Saturday night we have fireworks. So there's all kinds of things to do in Auburn, even if you aren't necessarily an automotive enthusiast. Absolutely. So this has been going on for, as you mentioned, several years now. What is new this year that folks can see? Uh, the biggest thing I think that is special this year is we've expanded some of our shopping opportunities. Oh, so okay. um, bring the ladies. Um, it, it's a fun time for everybody. We've got a new antique show this year, as well as um, my favorite new thing is a vintage market. So it's going to be vintage, upscale, mobile boutiques, all kinds of things um, to do some shopping, and that's on Saturday. That's very cool. My family's from Auburn. My grandmother used to volunteer at the museum, so they're showing videos of all these cars. Yeah. This is so cool. For those who haven't seen it like we have, encourage them why they should come out and, and be a part of this. Well, I always think the, the thing we used to say is it was for automotive enthusiasts, and now I say it's for everyone, because I think even if you don't necessarily own a car or plan to, to purchase a car during Auburn, um, I think it's a time where you can come and connect with the people. The owners of these cars are there, so they love to talk about their car and share information and um, really engage an, a new generation of people in this love affair with the automobile. Absolutely. And great Very for the cool. town of Auburn, and as you mentioned, a good family event, too. That's Right, that's right. And I think Northeast Indiana um, is really um, so fortunate to have this right in their backyard. Absolutely. Well, good luck Thank for you. another successful year. Thanks, Sarah. And Thank thanks you. so much for being here. Thanks for having us. The festival is tomorrow through September 5th. And as we said, it's the 60th year. 